Hello, it's Farming Sinus 9 here bringing you a uh, journal's profile, but more simplified version. Instead of going for 10 minutes, it's going to go for like probably 5, hopefully a bit less, that's the aim. But I'll start. Uh, I'm going to do a general's profile of uh, Field Marshal Bernard Law Montgomery, a uh, British Field Marshal in which he was born, his date of birth was the 17th of November 1887 in uh, Kennington, England. Um, his date of, de uh, date of death was the 24th of March 1976, uh, which he was aged at 88 years old. Um, the, pro um, the pros of uh, Field Marshal Montgomery is that during World War One, he managed to force the Germans out of their trench with the bayonet. During um, during uh, World War Two, he anticipated the fall of France and managed, and trained his troops accordingly to a retreat, which helped him in the end. Uh, he managed. He was sent to Egypt uh, for the Battle of Alamein, which he managed to stabilize the front for the first battle. Uh, he also anticipated the German attack and uh, strengthened his forces accordingly in that area. Um, after the second retreat of the German army in Africa, Montague was always able to keep on Rommel's was always able to keep Rommel's defenses um, using mass assaults. Um, in which also he was determined to use combined arms. So like. The army, in conjunction with the air force and the navy, um, he tried to visit the frontline units as much as possible. Um, yeah, during the Battle of the Bulge, Monty had re reorganized the U.S. defense to be shortened and strengthened, um, which included retreating from Saint uh, Saint Vith and thus disrupted the German advance into the Ardennes. Um, after the Rhine crossing across... Yeah, after the Rhine crossing, he managed to encircle Army Group B, um, and that's his pros. He was just a... very... like he... he was a well... disciplined general. Um, but he did have some flaws, so which included um, a lack of diplomacy um, uh, and the Denit the raid in which he helped craft was an utter failure. Um, Monty's Normandy invasion plan did not work as, as it seemed due to German resistance which forced them into unfavorable autumn conditions. Um, you persuaded Eisenhower to use Monty's plan for Operation Market Garden, which was a bold but poorly planned offensive in causing an Allied defeat in the Netherlands. Um, uh, during, yeah, and he also suffered injuries um, during his course of his military career, which was during World War One, where he was shot during after a counteroffensive. He was shot through a lot through his lung and through his knee by a sniper. Um, he has a whole list of achievements from his military crew, which included Viscountcy, which is actually not to do with the army, it's to do with his family, um, with, which he received at uh, UK, United Kingdom, in January 1946. Uh, Knight of the Most Noble Order of the Garter, uh, which he also received in 1946 in UK. Uh, Knight Grand Cross of the Most Honourable Order of the Bath, 1945. Companion of the Distinguished Service Order, 1914. Distinguished Service Medal, 1947. Chief Commander of the Legion of Merit, uh, 10th of August, 1943. Me um, Member of the Order of Victory, uh, 21st of June, 1945. First Class of the Order of Zavorov, uh, on the 16th of 1947. 
No, Crocs Degro, uh, 1919. Uh, Knight of the Order of the Elef Elephant, uh, the 2nd of August, 1945. Commander of the Order of George the uh, 1st, 20th of June, 1914. Uh, Silver Cross, 5th class of the Ver Verti Military, 31st of October, 1944. Uh, Grand Cross of the Order of the White Lion, uh, 1947. Grand Cordon of the Seal of Solomon, uh, 1949. Grand Officer with Palm of the Order of Le Leopold II, 1947. Crooks de uh, 1940 with Palm, Belgium. Uh, Grand Cross of the Order of the Dutch Lion, uh, 16th of January 1947, uh, Grand Cross of the Royal Norwegian Order of St. Olive, 1951, Medal Militaire, 1958, uh, Grand Cross of the Legion of Honor, May 1945, and, the war and finally the War Cross, 1939, in which it received in 1947. Um, that is it of uh, Bernard Law Montgomery. Uh, it was very shortened compared to my the other way I do it. Hopefully this is a better way of providing more information to you guys um, without making me bored and everything. Uh, without making yourselves bored and leaving my <laughs> video halfway through. But anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this new setup. And I'm Farming Sinesson.